Hello and welcome to GIFNinja.com's video tutorial section. Right now we're going to go through the process of using Windows Movie Maker to shorten up the length of a video file. So let's open up Windows Movie Maker. We're going to click Start, All Programs, Accessories, Windows Movie Maker. Now that we have Windows Movie Maker open, we need to get the file that we're working with. I have it right here on the desktop, so I'm just going to click on that and drag it into Windows Movie Maker. The goal I have right now is to get my file length down to four seconds so I can turn it into an animated GIF, GIF and use on my MySpace profile. Well, if you double click this, you see that this is a, it's a video of Tiger Woods and it's a 54 and a half second long video. It's got a bunch of extra video on there that I need to get rid of. So I'm going to click on the file again and drag it down into the timeline. So here we are in the timeline and I'm going to start at the beginning of the file and crop off some of the video from the front of the file. So I'm going to left click right here and drag to the right. As I'm doing this, all this is going to be removed. So I'm going to go up to the point where he hits the ball. You can see he hits the ball and I'm going to go back to right there. And just let go of the button and then everything that I just highlighted has been removed. Now I'm going to go to the end of the file and I'm going to left click there and drag to the left to remove some of the video off the end of the file. Showing him celebrating his shot and picking up the ball. So once the ball drops in, there we go. I'm going to get rid of all of that. I still have a 33 second long video. That's far too long, so I need to get some more off the beginning of the file still. We'll go right there. Now we have almost a 17 second video. There's one more thing we can do. We can right click on this and go to video effects. There's all kinds of video effects you can do, but the one I'm looking for right now is to speed up the play of the video. So I'm going to speed up double. I'm going to actually double it again and one more time. I'm going to speed it up double three times. Now I have a two second long video. Let's press play. It's a little fast. Let's see if I can take one of them doubles off. All right, now the video is 4.2 seconds, so I just need to zoom in on this timeline. I'm going to zoom in a little bit more and just take a little bit off the front of this file. There we go. Perfect. Right here you can see we have a four second video now. So now we have the desired video length that we've been looking for. Now all we have to do is save this file. So let's go over here into movie tasks and under three, finish movie, we can save to my computer. The name of it's going to be movie and it's going to save to my desktop. All these settings are default settings. I'm going to stick with these. I'm okay with that. I'm going to click next. And now it has made my movie. So that's how you crop down and use some time effects using Windows Movie Maker to make yourself an animated GIF at gifninja.com. Thank you for watching this tutorial.